Howdy guys, my name is Donkey Kong, and welcome back to Let's Play Sporkinator 64. Time to at last play Diddy's instrument on this pad. At night. Because I believe it will actually do something at night, unlike during the day when it did absolutely freaking nothing. Oh, we've got an owl. Oh, I totally know what voice I'm going to use for this. I've got this, man. He's about to say something, I just know it. Hoot. I don't speak to anyone without wings. Come back when you can fly. Because <laughs> that's the same voice I used for Kipora Kipora during Ocarina of Time uh, HD, the HD LP that I did that was also 100% run. You should totally check out that Let's Play, by the way. I went for 100% and I got it done within 50 or 51 parts, which was pretty cool. So now I just have to find and locate... Pff, find and locate are basically the same thing. I gotta find that jet barrel. It's somewhere around this area. Shoot, man, I don't know where it is. I have a feeling it's over here, though, like this wide open blank area here with nothing in it. I think it's just ahead of me, but it's not visible until you get close. See how- that's ridiculous. I, I hate stuff like that. I actually had a hard time finding it, because I couldn't even see it. Anyway, see if I can't fly back to the owl before I run out of crystals, and maybe we can do something to get a golden banana, because that's generally our goal here. Owl, sir. Hoot! Let's see if you can fly through my course of rings around this tree. Oh, good lord. I freaking messed it up somehow. Um, what do? Seriously, what do? Do I go back to the jet barrel and what's gonna happen now? Um, can we try this again? I wasn't ready and did he freaking landed and I lost my jet wings or whatever. Do I have to play the instrument again? Are you serious? Oh my gosh. Well, welcome to Super Failure 64. Fine, we'll do the thing again! Ah, are you serious? I can't believe it. I'm not reading this again, no. You you had one you had one chance, Owl, and you blew it. No, 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 no. And skipped. Come back when you can fly. Now I have to go to the jet barrel again and fly up to him again! At night. I'm never gonna let that go. That whole at night thing. <laughs> That's gonna keep going until it's daytime again. <laughs> oh man, okay. So this time, I'll be ready for you. Alright, Owl. Show me your obstacle course. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I'm ready. This time I'm not gonna land. And I, at least they give you infinite crystals for this, so at least I can just hover here until he creates the first ring. Uh, first ring, yeah. Super handy indeed. This is kind of like what we did in Angry Aztec. It's good, probably going to be equally annoying too. Except that bird was like an... Was it an ostrich? No, it wasn't an ostrich. It was a funny looking pelican, I want to say. I'm not even sure what kind of bird that was back in Angry Aztec. Probably a weird looking pelican like bird. I don't know though. Like a lot of these creatures may not even exist in real life. Like the Kremlings? Yeah, I mean, yeah, they're based on crocodiles and stuff. But they don't exist. Okay, is this the last ring? I would be so happy if- nope, not the last ring. And I missed it, I flew over it. Okay, there we go, forward! Forward, Diddy, forward, you can do it! You have to, like, literally just tap the button. Really? They're putting the ring right above the tree. They know what they did. They made that hard on purpose. Oh, good lord. Fine, yeah, I'm gonna guess I'm gonna freaking try this again. Alright, here we go. I knew this would be equally annoying. See, I, I told you guys, I just knew it. I called it. Gosh, this is really the downfall of this game, is stupid crap like this. It's not even a ring, it's a 2D sprite. I mean, the least you could have done was give me a 3D model so I can see what I'm doing. Where the heck am I going? Where are all the rings? Fine! We'll start over again! Good freaking lord! Okay. Ring number one. Deja vu. Ring number two. I'm falling for you. Ring number three, above the tree. Come on. Okay, ring number four, near the door. Ring number five, man alive. Oh crap. Oh crap. For real? I don't know why this is so hard. And every time I start over, I'm losing like one or two crystals because they deactivate the infinite crystal coconuts temporarily. That's really making this hard. Good freaking lord. I hate this. 
Can't wait to be done with this one now. Alright, so that's ring number four above the door, if I recall correctly. I want to keep going with my rhyme. Ring number five, man alive. And I was going to say ring number, ring number six, pick up sticks, because I guess that's the obvious thing that it rhymes with, because I couldn't think of anything else. Ring number seven, shooting for heaven. Ring number eight is going to be great. Ring number nine, I fly through all the time. Ring number ten, let's not have to do this again. Oh my gosh, ring, num ring number eleven, what a hassle. Ring number twelve, nothing rhymes with twelve. Ring number thirteen. Also doesn't rhyme with anything. I don't even care anymore. Ring 14. Ring 15. Maids in the kitchen? I don't know. Ring 16. 16. 16. It's a lot of freaking rings. Did I get it? I knew I should have made the course harder. I knew I should have made the course harder, but I suppose you've earned a prize. There we go. I've got the proper voice that time. Oh my gosh. That wasn't even- that's not even its final form! It's a freaking bonus barrel! Okay, I'm gonna get those bananas and then head on into that. Oh gosh, what do we have in here? Shoot, man. I can't believe that was- <laughs> They're really making these bananas harder, I tell you what. Oh, this is bar Busy Barrel Barrage! Or should I say Busy Barrel Barrage? Survive the onslaught! Press B to shoot! I think we've actually done this before with another Kong. Now, it's the opening part that's really tricky. Once you get this thing going, Welcome it's easy. Just try to figure out which enemy to shoot first and how many times I have to shoot them to actually have them die. See, there we go. Once we get past the opening attack, it's gonna be pretty easy. Because now I can I can, I can pre-shoot them and get them to die one at a time so they, in turn, respawn one at a time. And it gets easier as it goes on. There we go. So there's right. Oh, gotta go for left, then up. Cause this must have been the, the order I can- Oh, there's down sneaking up on me. <gasps> no! Alright, I lied. It does not get easy. It's just gonna be tricky all throughout. That's fine with me. Welcome to bonus stage. Just when I thought I was getting bored with this game, it got harder. So that's actually kind of a good thing. Haha! No! Don't you dare. I think the last time we did this, we were Chunky Kong and the pineapples, I think, killing one hit. But these are peanuts, so you have to fire a bunch of times for it to even work. I mean, I could just spin around, but I don't know how how likely that is to succeed. <laughs> Alright, we just need to survive for 25 more seconds, and we've got this. Got this in the bag, man. <gasps> no, 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 no. Holy crap. There's more directions than I thought. Some of them approach diagonally, and I'm not, I'm never ready for that. Come on, busy barrel barrage. Don't barrage me. Or, I keep saying barrage. It's actually pronounced barrage. That's the real pronunciation. I kid you not, but... Anyway, two, one, I win. Well I did it! Yay! Arguably one of the trickiest bananas in the game, just because you have to fly through rings to even get the bonus barrel to appear in the first place. Oh, man. That's like the first banana we've even gotten with Diddy in this place, which is pretty sad, because I've been in... How long have I been in this uh, course? Uh, Fungi Forest, that is. Probably been in here for like two or three episodes. I'm not even sure. I don't know. But shoot, what do next? I honestly don't know. Because I did the rabbit race, I got my stupid consolation prize of coins. So that's technically done for now. Then I did Diddy Kong with the thing, and I think there was something with Tiny Kong, but I already did that. So... We have many options for what I could do next. Or should I say, I have many options. Probably just gonna continue exploring the course and see what else we can find, because I know there's other stuff we can do with Diddy. Not necessarily here, but other places. Like, I remember there was this one place at the top of that really big mushroom, and there was like a gate blocking off stuff during the day, but now that it's nighttime, that might be open. My only question is, where is the five warp? It's not actually around here, is it? It's like out in the blue somewhere, because the five warp, I believe, takes me straight to the top of the mushroom. So, I just need to find that one if I can. It may just be out of view. I can't remember. It, ha it has to be around here somewhere, though, right? Or is it in that other area? I think I have to take the two warp first. See, that's, I can't never remember this place, even with the positioning of the warp pads. There's one. There's two. Because two, where does two go? Right in front of the mushroom, right? Oh, it takes us to Funky Kong. Well, that's not what I wanted, but 
We've got the bean. I don't know if we have to be Tiny Kong for this or not, but it probably is wise to switch in. That's not a tag barrel, genius. This is a tag barrel, so I'm gonna switch to Tiny Kong. Go ahead and plant that bean that we found elsewhere. I had to- I literally actually had to freeze frame on that in editing so you could at least see what it looked like, because Tiny picked it up instantly based on where I was standing. Oh gosh, the evil tomatoes strike again, run! I would never want a pizza with sauce made from these tomatoes. I wouldn't eat that, man. I'd give it to someone else as a cruel joke. Skeleton war is always on. We're eliminating the skeletons one at a time. I planted a thing. Oh look, I've got a stalk and some leaves at last. Come on up and collect your reward. Oh gosh, it's so hideous. Oh. Is he covering his eyes because it's nighttime or what? What's he doing? Ugh! <laughs> that face. Oh, do I have to shrink? I don't have to shrink, do I? I don't think I do. Squawks, please, I need your help. Please, help me get the banana. What? What do you think I am, an eagle? You're far too heavy for me, tiny brah! I do have to shrink, duh! Oh man, I should have known that. I should have known. Squawks, please end the cutscene. Oh, you know, you could just carry the banana downward. Squawks! Good lord, Squawks. I'm sorry, man. All right, I didn't realize this was right here. Otherwise, I would have totally done this first. All right, time to do it properly. Where am I freaking going? I can't see. Everything is so big now that I'm small. It's like it feels like they scale the whole game upward. It really does feel like you're small. Well done, Nintendo and Rareware. Well done. You even walk slower, too. Your movement scales down to how big you are, which is what would happen in real life if shrinking were possible. Because, yeah, that's what happens when your legs are shorter. You, care, you uh, cover less distance with each step. Oh, man, they did, they did a perfect job of scaling down the movement speed with the physical scaling. Brock, hold on tight. Here we go, tiny Brock. So now I've finally been collecting this golden banana up here, and I still think there's actually another one with Donkey Kong that I need to collect that I said I was going to get before, but never got around to. And then there's also another place where I can get a banana with, I think, Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong. Got to cancel the transformation here so it doesn't eat up all my crystals. And there's watermelon here. The skeletons respawn too? Well, I'll never be able to end the skeleton war at this rate. Good lord. I'm already at full health, so who even cares? Well, that was worth coming back for. I don't think there's anything else for me to do in this area with any of the other characters. I mean, I could be wrong, right? <gasps> Tiny's bananas! Oh, I'm so glad I spotted those. Oh, it's only one. <gasps> there's my missing banana taking me from 69 to 70. Well, that explains why I only had 69, as funny as and entertaining as that was. I'm gonna switch to Donkey Kong now. There's a certain area I'm looking for. I don't know if I'll find it. And I still need to go up to the top of the mushroom like I said I was gonna do, but... Where's the warp out of here? It's right in front of in front of Funky's store. So it's not two. Where does three take me? I'll probably have to take the three warp to go to where I'm trying to go. So let's give that a try. It's like, I never remember where these things freaking go, man. Oh, so three's the one in front of the mushroom. Okay. And from this area, we can find five. Yeah, it's right here. Very curious now to see what's at the top. Not the area I was... This is not the area I said I was looking for, but... It, oh, there's homing ammo. We can get the red crates now. That's gonna be fun. Yeah, because I'm pretty sure this is a spot that was blocked off here. Oh, it's a battle arena pad with Diddy's coins that I don't really need. So I could come back here with Diddy, but screw it. I'll just do the battle as Donkey Kong. Wow, so I found the battle crown in Fungi Forest. Kamikaze Kremlings! Wow, I love the alliteration and the use of wording there. It's perfect. Oh, good lord. I'm gonna have to use my charge attack to get through this. This is freaking difficult with all the freaking cast flats. And rolling around, I think, is too risky. I'll just fall off the edge. And you walk slower when you're fully charged. This is as fast as I can go. It's amazing. Oh, the timing on that was perfect. I got all three of them. I don't want to- I want to use as few crystals as I can. Oh, that was overkill. I could have just killed that guy normally and it would have been no problem. Whatever, though. It's only the cast blasts that matter. 
If the green guy just comes at me by himself, I shouldn't use a crystal. I should just kick him in the face. There we go. Kick to the face with two feet. Oh, come on. I should really be invincible while performing my power move, but whatever. One and well played. Battle crown get. Well, so that's not a golden banana, but I still do value those because they are kind of part of the collectibles. And there's only one in each level, so not too much to complain about there. I would jump down, but I kind of like to get down legit using the warp pad instead of just jumping down and taking damage. Because I don't know what else there is to do in this big mushroom, if anything. I think we are kind of done with this area. And if I don't quite get all the bananas by the end, with the exception of one of Lanky's bananas, I'll consult the guide and see if I missed anything. Because I've got the guide for Fungi Forest open in a tab, but I try not to use it unless I have to. Because I had glanced at it yesterday and I was like, yeah, tomorrow when I record, I'm not going to remember any of that. But it's fine, it's fine. Okay, so now I have to decide what am I looking for. It's another area. We've been through it before during the day. It was blocked off because it needed to be nighttime. And I don't think it was actually around here. I may have to either travel through the tunnel or take one of the warps to get to it. I'm not sure where it was. Well, here we go with some more seemingly blind exploration. Oh man, I know what that area looks like. It's not near Cranky's lab like I thought it was. At least I don't know. No, it's not. It's just not there, man. Well, I can go a little faster with rolling. Well, I'm back in the pendulum room. I'm kind of thinking that maybe the green door was where I wanted to go. Where did that lead to? Oh, that led to uh, Funky and the Evil Tomatoes, right? I think that's where this goes. Yeah, we've been there. That's not what I'm looking for. That's right. This kind of reminds me of the Water Temple. It's almost like a maze with multiple passages, except I don't even have a map. So a lot of this is kind of hit or miss with where I'm freaking going. And I never know if I should edit it down or just talk through it to stay entertaining. But it's whatever. Okay, it's the area with the water wheel. This is actually what I was looking for. Isn't there a warp around here, though, that's supposed to take me here easily? Yeah, see, that area there is what I had in mind. So we'll probably get to that shortly. Oh, the one warp. Is that what it is? Oh, I could have taken the one warp. I didn't know that. Now I know. Cause, well, I, I should have known that because I've been here before, obviously, but I just couldn't remember. But wasn't my banana somewhere around here for the taking? There it is. We did this forever ago. Or at least it feels like forever ago. Now we actually collected it. It was the Conveyor Belt of Death. That's actually the last episode that I uploaded at this point in time. I'll be uploading episode 29 tonight, and I think right now I'm recording episode 30. This is going to be 30, 31, and 32 in this session. All right, so enough dawdling. I finally found the area that I was considering doing, because there's bananas here. Okay, good. Already got his banana medal, but every banana helps. Like I said, we need, like, what, 300 to fight the boss, and probably 350 in the next level? There's probably going to be a level where I need 400 bananas to fight the boss. Hopefully that's the one I'm thinking it is, because it actually makes it a lot easier. And by the way, these walls will hurt you. They're dangerous. And this area will hurt you. It's freaking dangerous. So, naturally, they've placed an invincibility barrel here for Donkey Kong to use. So we're going to go ahead and hammer this out. Got some bananas. Now I'm going to jump up and slam that switch. And it should do a thing. All switches do things. Okay, so now I need to run back around to the front and go in there. I'm not sure which route is shorter. I'll just go this way. I don't need to be invincible to enter there. There we go. And we're in. I think there's something around this general area that Diddy can do, too. Not inside here, but I think on the outside. And considering how late we are in this episode now, I'll probably get to that in the next one. Oh, I wasn't fully charged because I let go and nothing happened. Which was strange to me. Yeah, he tries to hit me with a club and it doesn't work. I'm a bit low on health and there's a watermelon box here. Never thought I'd actually want one of these, but there you go. And that was way more than I needed, but still. They'd all disappear anyway. A little low on crystals, gonna get those. And considering that there's a ladder here, probably need to climb up. Something here, though. Pretty sure I need to slam this box to break it. Okay. Okay, I suspect I know what's going to happen when I hit this. And I don't know why it's green. It should just be blue, because by now you're supposed to have the blue slam. The Super Simeon slam. Oh, yep, that's what I thought. 
bonus barrel, vines, and a time limit. So just gotta find that ladder, climb straight up, and we can make it into that barrel and see what horrors await us. Okay. Okay, the vines are over on this side. Ten. Nine. Eight. It's gonna be tight. Seven. Six. Oh, crap! Good lord. I didn't grab the vines. All right, let's try again. Do 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 do. Dink do 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 Dank memes. Sixty four. Wish I had some dank memes for this video, but I think I'm all out of memes. I'll have to consult with the meme lord and resolve this issue. But anyway, twelve, eleven. Got to turn the camera so I can see here. Okay, seven, six, five. Four, and we're in. There we go. If this is an easy minigame, I'll go ahead and knock it out. Oh, it's Minecart Mayhem! It's literally my favorite minigame in the entire game! Avoid the TNT carts. To speed up, press Z to slow down. Press B to change lanes. Use the control stick at any junction. Good luck. And there's two of them now. Oh, this is awesome! I'm just gonna chill here. They're gonna go to the inside, so I'm gonna go back to the outside at this junction here. I might need to slow down. I'm not sure. Because that guy's on the outside, so I have to go to the inside here. But then I'm gonna run into that other TNT card. So let's speed up here and pass him up. Slow down, slow down. I went too fast. Oh no, I'm supposed to go to the outside and I missed my, my chance. Okay, we're going to the super inside. That'll allow me to dodge him. Okay, so now I'm going back to the outside. And now back to the outer ring, the super outside. Six, five, four. They don't stand a chance. Three, two... One, and got it on the first try. I told you this was my favorite minigame. I have seen a lot of people, at least I think a lot of people, might have trouble with the Minecart Mayhem minigame when there's multiple carts to dodge like that. But it's not that hard. You watch where they go, and then you watch where they have to go next, and you consider the fact that they will always switch to the inside if you're on the inside when they reach the junction. So then you time it right so that you can switch to the outside and avoid them. But anyway, I guess I'm going to get out of here. I don't think there's anything else in here. It's gonna be end of episode soon. We are definitely over 20 minutes. We're at like 22 and a half now. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else in here. I really wanna be thorough though. Cause there's this box here, but I think it's just for looks. It's just a, it's just a thing. It doesn't do anything. Yeah, like I said, I'll consult the guide later if I find out that I missed bananas or golden bananas or whatever. Gotta get out of here. And I will see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Donkey Kong 64. I am the Sporkinator. And I thank you for watching. May we meet again in the future. Gotta find a tag barrel at some point. But anyway, goodbye for now.